I am not in love with this day, good brother. Yeah, let's go. Come on. Good brother. Kenny. Don Aconda. Don. Guys. No, well, maybe they're not there. They're not inside. Clearly. Otherwise, he would answer the door. Or maybe they are. No, they would. What do you think this is about the tag titles? We're gonna get the tag titles back as soon as Finn and Juice get back from Japan. They're ours. No, this can't be. What's going on? I don't know. Let's not stand here like Marks. Huh? Let's not stand here like Marks. Oh, maybe some paranoia setting in. You know how wrestlers can be. Ladies and gentlemen, accompanied to the ring by the invisible hand, Don Collis, the AEW World Champion, Kenny Omega. The magnitude of this moment weighs on the sport of professional wrestling. With regards to the title versus title match at Rebellion, I've had people come up to me and say, oh, this is like Backlund versus Race. And I say, no. They go, oh, well, it's like when Jumbo Sharuda unified. I said, no. This is unlike anything we've ever seen in professional wrestling. This is a first in this business. And I, it, in this day and age, it's hard to say anything is a first. But this is a first where the AEW champion, Kenny Omega, is going to take on the Impact World Champion, Rich Swan. winner take all. Nothing like this has ever happened in wrestling before. There are times where words cannot do a picture justice. You look at the beautiful All Elite Wrestling Heavyweight Championship over the shoulder of Kenny Omega. The picture of Don Callis cavalierly going up the steps. All of it just weighs heavy. And right now, you've got to realize Rick Swan is somewhere close to a monitor. He wants to hear exactly what Don and Kenny have to say. Oh, we all do. Yeah, we. I mean, every monitor is sold out in the locker room. We know it. You know, I was taught to know my place. I know my place. So I'm going to be quiet. Let the stars do the talking. Came out here dressed like this, do you think I just want to hear the sound of my own voice? Huh? You better have those mics ready next time, okay? You can fire her if you want. It's fine. You do whatever you want here. Time is my most valuable resource, and you're wasting it. Don, please. We'll get some better people in here. I, we're due for a house cleaning. You can fire whoever you want. This is your home as well as my home, Kenny Omega. And soon. This land is your land. I love this. This land. It's my life. Did you just come up with that? God, you're I a did. Is, is there anything you Trade can't do, market. Kenny Omega, by God? Soon this won't just be your home. Soon you will also have the title belt, the world championship associated with this home. And as I often do, you know, preparation is so important. I've been doing a little preparation. I've been greasing the wheels, so to speak, you know. I came out here last week and I had a little talk with our Impact World Champion, Rich Swan, And I told him how great he is, because he's a great athlete. I mean, you were in the ring with him. Phenomenal. Fantastic. Fantastic athlete, great wrestler, great human being, too. And you know, you think? I place a high standard on human beings. I mean, they got to be a good person to work here, Kenny. You Absolutely. Know what I mean? He's a great person. But I pointed out to Rich Swan, Kenny, uh -huh that the one problem he has, uh -huh. he can make all the money, uh -huh. he can have a beautiful wife and family, uh -huh. he can make a miraculous recovery from a broken leg, uh -huh. but the one thing he can never get out of his head is the one-winged angel! Woo! That you hit on him! I did! At hard I had to kill. pull out the big guns, baby! You did, and you beat them one, two, three. It made the highlight real, didn't it, Don? Did it ever. Forever. <laughs> this company will have that as a highlight. And forever, it'll run in Rich Swan's head. And you know, Kenny, when an athlete gets something in their head, it's real hard to get it out. So here's the deal, Rich. You can prepare all you want. At the end of the day, 
He just has to hit that move and it's over. No one has ever kicked out of the One Wing Ninja, am I right? No one, not one person, not one person ever has kicked out of the One Wing Ninja. And you're no exception, Rich, and you felt that firsthand at the last pay-per-view. I thought it'd give you a little bit of taste of things to come because yes, I did see where things were going. I saw where the future lied. And Mr. Callis, now that we've laid the groundwork for one Rich Swan, I'm thinking that this 25 pounds isn't enough. I think you need more gold. I and need more. I think that when we get Kenny Omega, the greatest wrestler in the history of professional wrestling, bigger than Hackenschmidt, bigger than Gotch, bigger than Fez, bigger than Flair, bigger than Hogan, bigger than Moxley, bigger than Keep going! I Keep going! Tonight, but we're gonna run out of air time. Bigger than Ibushi! God, I love this! Bigger than Ibushi. And people say to me, are you letting the wolf in the hen house? What happens, oh my God, if Kenny Omega, the AEW World Champion, wins the Impact World title? I mean, Don, I I have a piece of what goes on around here. Uh -huh. I'm an executive here. Let me tell you something that I'm prepared to do. I'm gonna tell all the fans of Impact Wrestling and the people who work here. What I'm prepared to do is anything it takes to ensure the legacy and the greatness of this man. I want competition. We want the best here. Rich Swan wants the best, and I am prepared to suck every drop of blood, every resource, suck every talent. Suck I will suck it out of this company. Suck him and chuck him, Don. If it helps, Kenny by God Omega. And that's what we're gonna do. Rich Swan, you're hey. great. You're gonna have a great career, but not as Impact World Champion, yep. because all it's gonna take is a one-winged angel. And just in case, Kenny, uh -huh. I have had my production staff no. put together a Academy Award winning vignette of sorts. Oh boy, I didn't know this was coming. That is a tribute to the greatest finishing move in the history of the wrestling industry. Rated number in one, the baby. history of this sport. Let's all sit around, get the popcorn, and watch over and over and over again the one winged. Angel of Kenny by God Omega. Let's check it out, Kenny. Cue it up. Oh, this is, this is this great. Nice. Look at that. That's perfect form. I have no idea. Oh, ooh. I have no idea, Kenny. How did you even come up with that move? I mean, no one else could even do it. Oh, it's good. That, that's me, Mr. Good. Callis. Let's, let's be in there. Let, let's have a viewing party. Let's invite some of our paid friends Whoa. to come over and watch this. Oh, I, I just can't get enough, Kenny. Well, that was great. Kenny, let's get the long version. We'll have some people buy the house. Maybe we can invite the Bucks. We'll come over and we will watch that video. What did you think? Do you think Rich Swan liked that, Kenny? I you don't think he, liked, think he it? liked it one bit. Hey, look. The, from the first time I came here, Don, to impact wrestling. There was this all-encompassing fear around the locker room. Everyone started to walk on eggshells because they knew that the champion was there. They knew that the greatest man to ever lace him up had arrived to impact. And there was no reason for me to be there aside for what you're holding, Rich Swan. <laughs> you see, now, I get it. I get it. You want to have your name etched in history alongside Kenny Omega. Unfortunately for you, Rich, you'll be just a footnote in what was a history-making moment. You see, Rich Swan, I'm not sure really what you've accomplished from your inception of pro wrestling until now. It doesn't matter, I don't remember any of it. But rest assured, Impact Wrestling, from the first day that I graced your promotion. It was the greatest day of your promotion's life. But for me, it was Tuesday. Nothing more, <laughs> nothing less. And at the pay-per-view, when I had two, count them, two more belts to my collision, 
Those fears that you had when I stepped through those doors. Those fears of looking weak, of looking inferior, they're all gonna come true. And it's just a God-given fact that everyone knew you had no one that could compete with me. You had no one that could step up to me. You have no one that can beat me. And until I slip on a banana peel, until I come down with perhaps some deadly strain of virus, no one is prying those belts off of me unless I'm cold and dead and in the ground. This day, Impact Wrestling, consider it one of your last days of grace. Because at the pay-per-view, I'm coming for you, Rich. And I don't care what it takes, I am taking those titles with me. And it's all in the name of professional wrestling. This is more about you. This is more than Impact Wrestling. This is more than AEW. This is more than wrestling in America and Canada. History! This is history. So sit down, heat up a bag of popcorn, get your favorite soda pop, sit down with a bucket of ice cream melting in between those legs of yours and watch the friggin' show and enjoy it! Because at Rebellion, Kenny Omega and Don Callis will do what we have done ever since this started. The thing we've been planning for 27 years, we over and over. will over and over. make over and over. history! Over and over and over and over! Hit the music. <laughs>